Hello everyone and welcome back for another mod review. Today we're going to be taking a look at two cat vehicles. We get a semi and a tractor, very powerful pieces of equipment. We're going to be taking them out on the road and then the field and we're going to put them to the test. So let's start with the tractor. We'll do a little walk around here, very sharp looking. I love those rims. Just looks sharp man. Very, very detailed. It's got a nice shine onto it. Not bad. This is a challenger as well jump inside. First I'm going to take you to the shop guys. We'll go over the specs from there. Mods, tractor, okay. This is the Cat MT955 hand mode. Now I take it the hand mode, I noticed in the interior view you can see his arm up on the wheel so I don't know if that's what that means or not. Uh, the file size is 23.6 megabytes. This guy's very very powerful, 441 kilowatts and 600 horsepower. Uh, the price for this is 435000 in the shop, $150 a day maintenance fee, and that's about it for now. So let's take a look at the interior of this. Why does it say 600 horsepower there? Oh yeah, that is, it's 600. That's right. Okay, back. Let's jump inside. Sounds like a beast. We get a fully animated farmer inside. Nice. Uh, I'm not sure if the door is open on this or not. I don't think so. Yes, the doors do open on this. Let's take a look inside. You got a big old arm. <laughs> I think that's the hand, the hand mode. I'm not too sure, but very nice interior. Not bad at all. Good job. So let's check the doors, because it said the doors can open, now maybe I have to do it from inside perhaps? Keypad 9, what's that? Oh, look at that! Damn! That looks even more monsterly now. Okay. So, let's go, and we'll hook this guy up. I, I got the most powerful... Uh, piece of equipment to put this thing to the test. You need 400 horsepower to be able to pull that that uh, cultivator there. So we'll hook onto that. This thing drives so smooth too. It sounds really, really tough. Hook up, sir. Okay, we're going to bring you over to a field that we already own. Perhaps 19. I want to kind of take you for a little drive. Oh, Jesus. It is a little touchy. I'm trying to control it, but what a sharp looking tractor man, I love the smoke coming out of the stack, I love that little horn on the front too, it looks, just makes it look badass, what do we got here, what are we looking at for speed, 60, about 63 kilometers this guy goes, oh he's a little slippery, you could probably mess around with the settings to give him a little bit more traction I'd imagine, let's unfold this dude and get him on the field. So I'm, I thought it said, let me go in the cab, because I thought it said you could open the doors in this, but... I must have uh, put that in the wrong place, I suppose. But this guy's a beast, man. Look at him. Alright. Let's pull you up. Back up a little bit. Drop the implement down. And we're going to start cultivating. Oh my god, yeah, it's dragging this along with ease. Another thing I wanted to test, guys, I just gotta grab my keyboard there. Just wanted to look over the lights, make sure our beacons work. We got headlights. We got reverse lights. Nice reverse lights, too. Uh, headlights for the back, I should say. And horn. Good. I think that's about it. Now we're going to try to attempt to hire a worker. Oh, signal lights. Hazards. They all work. Excellent. How come the outside ones don't blink? They're probably just brake lights, I'd imagine. Or just tail lights. Okay, let's hire a worker and see. Okay, you can hire a worker with no problem. So, that is the Cat MT955 hand mode. 23.6 megabytes. Okay, let's jump over. Oh, great. 
Okay, let's fold you up and get you off the field. Oh, good God. Okay, just chill for a minute, dude. Let me... Where's he gonna go? He's gonna get stuck on a tree. Damn, I hate those trees being there. I forgot that about this map. Hold on, Chuck. We'll fix you. You didn't get all messed up here. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. <clears throat> Fighting off cold. Let's start him up the other end. Yeah, he is a little slippery, but you can adjust that with your, uh... If you go into your game's vehicle settings, I'd imagine you can, uh... Adjust that so it's not so slippery. I don't know what it is with the cat equipment. They're super powerful, but they're a little slippery. But that's fine. Okay, you're off. We're getting a little lag here. Not too bad. Let's jump over to our other guy. Oh, we were just there. Okay, now this is a sharp looking mod, man. The only complaint I have about this mod so far, guys, is the file size. It's a, it's over 100 megabytes, this file. What is it? 140.4 megabytes. I don't know why the hell that file is so big, but there is a lot of detail in it, but I still can't uh, see why it would be so much. Beacons. Uh, lights. F. Reverse lights. Australia plates on it. Okay, we got some reverse lights. Yeah, this guy, I think the motor doesn't really... Start. Like, see how quiet it is until you press the gas? It won't move. Okay, first, before we look inside, I'm going to take you over to the shop. Very nice looking. I love that in the back, man. That looks so nice. Very, very sharp. Look at the interior, man. I'm not big on the uh, upholstery, those beaded, bally things, but whatever. Let's take a look or, over to the shop. Let's go over to the mods and to our trucks. There he is. That is the Cat Caterpillar Truck Version 1. File size is 140.4 megabytes. It's crazy too big, but I don't know. There must be a reason for it. Uh, power, 588 kilowatts, 800 horses. Now, this thing's a beast. The price is $317,256 in the shop. The daily maintenance fee is $275. And I think that's about it for now. Now, let's go look at the interior. Very nice looking interior. I'm not big on this, but no, not a big deal. Not a big deal. I don't see any options to do anything here. I thought one of these said they could open the doors, but... Let me try that again. No, it's not allowing me to. So yeah, like I said, you jump in the truck and you can just... And as soon as I touch W... You can hear it fire up. Okay, let's hook on to the tipper. And we'll just take this guy for a little drive down the road and we'll... Well, first we'll fill them up and see how we can handle the weight. With 800 horsepower, I'd imagine he'll laugh at this. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Okay, it got a different connecting sound. That's different, but... I love that semi, man. It's fucking nice. It's really sharp looking. Okay. Yeah, we're good on the horns. We didn't... I know we... Tr okay, slow down there. Whoa, 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 whoa. I know we tried the lights, but I forget if we tried the, uh, the lights. Oh, sorry guys, I'm all over the place here. Let me get a little closer so I can see that. Yeah, that works. That works. Hazards work. Beacons work. Okay, we're good. Let's go fill up some grain and go for a drive. Yeah, I'm liking this Emmy, man. Look at the four big old smokestacks on it. It's a powerhouse, too. Let's fill up with... What do we got here? I don't think I have too much grain on this map. Let me quickly go over here. Oh, we got all kinds of canola. We'll get some canola. Canola. And then we'll take a blast down the road and see how this handles. Is our cultivator stuck over there? Yeah, it looks like he may have hit a tree. 
Oh well. Yeah, very sharp looking truck. I like that. It really caught my eye when I seen it. Maybe that back door opens. Close cover, stop filling. Detach. Let me jump out for a minute and just see that. Yeah, it's not going to allow me to do that, is it? No, I thought maybe I could get in the uh, the sleeper part, but okay, we're filled. Let's put our beacons on and hit the road. It is kind of quiet at first, isn't it? Oh god, it's handle it's pulling this with ease. Oh, watch out there, dude. A little hard, little slippery, man. I don't know what it is with the cat vehicles. Look at this, flying down the road at 75 with a full load of canola. 59 tons and we're still cruising along at 75 kilometers an hour so very impressive definitely liking that go up over here and we'll fire this baby around take out every street sign in the way I like when they used to go flying remember that how come they don't go flying anymore yeah this guy's a beast man really liking this love the cat equipment Really, really enjoy the cat equipment. Okay, I'll just get this guy back to the yard, and we will wrap up this review. Is he grinding gears or what? Oh, yeah, he's. On. He might have to adjust a couple of the settings, but it's not bad. It's definitely not bad. So, guys, there you go. That is the cat. The other one is the cat MT. 955 hand mode and this is the cat caterpillar truck version 1.0 additional information will be down below i will put the link down there as well i hope you enjoyed this review and i'll see you in the next one take care guys